coming at you with my March purchases. So what I think I'm going to start doing is um, combining what I picked up and really loved during the previous month, so this month, March. So at every end of the month, instead of doing favorite videos, I am just going to do um, things that I picked up during the month that I've been loving. So basically with favorites, what I do hate about them is the fact that you can never get them when people show them because it is a few months later and stuff. So this way you guys will still be able to pick up everything is still current. This way I'm going to start doing like the hauls slash favorites at the end of every month. So if you guys are interested in what I picked up for the month of March and uh, some things that I'm obsessed with, keep on watching. Right, so I'm going to start with a few hair products. These were actually sent to me, uh, but basically because I've been doing my hair straight as opposed to wavy, uh, the way that I do it is completely different and I was looking for some new products and this stuff came in the mail right at the perfect time. I was sent uh, a range of this product. It is called, guys, I'm going to butcher the name, it's Shu Ayumura Art of Hair. So I was sent like five or six products from this brand and the two that I've been obsessed with is the Liquid Fabric Mineral Texture Spray. So I put this in while my hair, like when I just come out of the shower, after I put in my mousse, I just spray this in. It has heat protectant in it and um, it really does give that extra volume and it adds texture to your hair when it's just really clean. And then uh, for the flyaways on top, I put the Kango Feather Tenacious Hold and I just put like literally like the size of a pea, rub it in my hands and I just put it on top of my hair to just lower all the, the fuzzies. And this really does give this, I mean it's paste, but it really does push down all those like flyaways and it keeps the volume and it doesn't take away what you've done as opposed to some of the paste I've used in the past. So these are my two hero products by Shu Aimura, this company right here. I'll show you guys some close-ups just so you guys can see what they look like. Um, but I also, I, they also sent me three other things, which um, I haven't had a chance to try yet, but if you guys have, let me know because I'm looking forward to, looking forward to starting to use these. So they also sent me the Detail Master Directional Fixing Spray, so I'm guessing it's some sort of a hairspray. They also sent me the Texture Wave, it's a dry finishing spray, which you guys know me, I love that stuff. And they also sent me the Wonder Worker, so it's a blow dry perfecter. So I'm looking forward to try these three products during the month. Uh, but for now, those two that I had showed you first off, those are my two favorites. All right, next, let's jump into jewelry. So I ordered some pieces from Ariel's new line, Ariel from Ariel Cristiana here on YouTube. She uh, came out with some jewelry pieces. I am so obsessed with it. I think it's called Delica um, for delicate, but in French. So I got my pieces yesterday and she threw in this extra necklace for me. So it's like a leather lariat and it just has these like dangle like little points at the end. And this is how it arrived. I thought it was really cute. So they all come in these little individual packages. So you have the little brown bags. It says the name on it in silver or if you have the silver bag, it comes with the gold writing. So this one is called the needle lariat absolutely love this piece and then the two pieces that I had ordered are right here so I have the pitted baguette ring so let me show you guys what that looks like I got mine in a size 5 because I wanted to do um, ring finger or pinky finger and it is adjustable so it's the super cute gold plated ring I got mine in gold and it has the little two um, stones, you have the round stone and the rectangle stone. I am so happy with this. It looks so beautiful on the hand. It looks so great with the stack that I usually wear. And I'm really, really, really excited about having this piece added. Another piece that I ended up picking up are the bar earrings in silver. These are sterling silver. This is what they look like because I wear different earrings on, on each ear, so I don't match my earrings. But this is the bar, what it looks like on my ear. I absolutely love this earring. It's so on trend. It's so perfect. And I love the fact all my earrings are sterling silver, so I don't need to take them off when I shower because they start taking off when you have piercings, like more than just two earrings. It's a little annoying. So it goes perfectly well with my day to day, just earrings that I never take off. And those were called the bar earrings in silver. So I also picked up these little twirly earrings here. They're absolutely stunning. I picked them up from the primary website. Um, it's where you guys know I do 90% of my shopping. So uh, they're just these really cute like twirl earrings. And if you don't have 
multiple piercings. When you put them on, it looks like you have like a second pierced hole, which looks really, really cute on. So I'm really excited about these. These have a really good price point. I have a coupon code below for these, so I'm going to make sure to include them for 15% off on these bad boys. They come textured also. I got the smooth ones, but the textured ones are also really, really cute. Now, from the primary website, I finally bit the bullet and I bought a piece that I've wanted for a long time. It is this ring right here. It's a rose gold with real diamonds, evil eye. You guys know how I feel about evil eye. I have an evil eye here. I have one here. I have a tattoo. I like to feel protected. I like to get the bad juju away. So uh, I picked up this ring and it comes in so beautifully. This is how I received it. It's in a nice black box. The ribbon just says it's by Carbon and Hyde. It's the exclusive collection for Primary New York. So it just comes with a beautiful ribbon. It comes in a box like this that just says Carbon and Hyde. And here is the box it comes in and it just says carbon and hide and your ring would go right here but since I'm wearing mine, mine ain't in there. And you get just like this card here which is I guess the authenticity handcrafted from 14 karat gold and diamonds. We certify these jewelry are original carbon and hide. So these are, it's like their authenticity little card that came with the packaging. So I'm super hyped about this. I've wanted this ring for years and I'm super happy. I used my own promo code to get it because it was a nice um, discount off. 15% off on this ring made a big difference. So uh, yes, I'm super hyped about this ring. I really like how it sits just with my everyday day-to-day -day stack, like with my watch and my really like this whole look together. Speaking of the Primary New York website, I picked up two more things from them. I, guys, I'm obsessed with these Luana bags. I So I already have the circle, I have the mini circle, I have the Paley, I think it's called, I have the Ren, and now I have this bad boy here. I, it's called the Emmaus. I am obsessed with this bag. I have carried this pretty much all week. It is, guys, it is humongous. It literally fits everything I need to bring with me on a daily, except for my uh, Louis Vuitton MM agenda, but this bag, is to die for. So it just has this train strap that I just have tucked in and it has these two little push locks that you just push to open and the bag itself is just one big box. I have it stuffed right now but it's a very structured, it's like a, a nice thick leather but it's still super, like the sides are still super smushy. Um, it's so soft. I mean the quality on these bags, I can't, I don't know for me, are what people should be buying the affordable handbag price points in. So forget the Michael Kors of the world. Go with a Luana. Go with something like this. It's not as known. It won't be as everybody is carrying the same bag. It's a good quality leather bag that you will not regret. So this for me is my one, two, three. It's my fourth Luana bag. So clearly I really, really love this brand. I think I'm actually going to do a video on how to pick a handbag if you don't want to go full on luxury designer. How to pick an affordable handbag. I think I'm going to work on a video like that. Thumbs up if you guys are interested in something like that because there are some great handbags out there that are not over $2,000 and this brand is one of them and I'm really hyped that I have discovered it and I'm really happy that Primary started carrying it because I can use my own promo code to get a discount. I also picked up these jeans here. They are by Hudson. They're the Krista Crop Super Skinny. I have these in the light wash already but I wanted a darker wash and the unfinished hem here shows so much more on the dark wash as opposed to the light wash. So I really needed these. On me, these are not cropped. I am, I'm really short, guys. These for me are the perfect length. They are like a full length jean on me. So if you guys are my size, I'm five foot two. These are the perfect super skinny jean. They stay super skinny and I'm very happy with them. I got mine in a size 25 and they were 209 uh, retail. And yeah, so they are the Hudson Krista crop super skinny and they're honestly super stretched so they're one of those really comfortable jeans. This is just what the butt looks like. Yeah, I'm very, very happy with these. I can't wait to put them on. I was leaving the tag. I wanted to wear them today, but I was leaving the tag on so I could show them to you guys. Next thing I picked up is for going out. So I don't wear hair extensions day to day anymore, but especially with my hair straight, I do like to wear them for volume when I do go out. And since I darkened my hair, I needed to get a new pair of hair extensions. So I picked up the Bombay hair. These are just clip-in. Sorry, I'm reading the back, see if there's anything um, that I can share with you guys. So they're just clip-in and they are Remy hair. They're obviously real hair. 
and uh, here is how they come. It, I took the 220 gram ones, and guys, look how lush this hair is. So, just so you can see the thickness, this is what the 220 grams looks like. So, just so you can see the clips that come in here, because I'll, I hate ordering hair extensions and not knowing what it is I'm going to get. So, you got four of the little baby, the onesie clips right here. You also get two two clip pieces right here. You got a three clip piece here, another three clip piece right here. I got two four clip pieces right here. So this for me is more than enough in terms of hair. I will just wear these right here. So I'm gonna wear the two three clips right here and I'm gonna stack the fours in the back. And that's how I do my going out hair. I always, just for a lot of people ask me because people are always surprised when they find out that I am wearing hair extensions when I do go out. They always ask me what's the key to make the hair extensions look natural. So for me, um, like I just got these and I haven't cut them yet. I always go into my hairdresser and I have her cut my hair extensions for my hair. So I put them in and she'll give me a haircut with these in and I'll mark where they're supposed to go on my head so that way they're shaped perfectly to go with my hair. That is the way to make clip-in hair extensions look like your hair. So uh, the picture, the color I picked up I think is in the dark brown. I'm going to link everything below uh, so you guys can um, go take it. And I love the fact that they come in this box because right now with my hair extensions I literally just have a bag full of hair extensions and I divide them up by brand and color. But this way I can just like know that these are my dark brown hair extensions and they have their own box that I'm going to neatly put in the drawer with the rest of my hair extensions in a bag. I finally bit the bullet and bought the Foreo. I bought this at Sephora. I bought the Luna too. I so I got my makeup done last year at Sephora, and the girl who um, was doing my makeup used this on me. And I was like, "What is this?" And I, when I saw it online at first, I was like, eh, "It's a bit expensive. I don't know. Let's see if it works." So I have waited a solid year to buy this. I have met friends who've bought it. I have gone to do my makeup a second time and they use this on me. I've watched tons of reviews online and I finally bit the bullet. I am obsessed with this. So it's a, um, I repackaged it so you guys could see exactly how it ends up coming. So you get it in this box like this. It looks super pretty. You can pick the color you want. I went with lilac because I thought it was pretty. Well, and plus the colors mean, um, the colors mean what type of skin type you have, and I have sensitive skin, so I went with lilac. And when you open it like this, it just comes like this, and you have your charger and a little portable bag for it, because basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring this with me when I travel, and uh, yeah. So here's what it says. It has T-Sonic pulsations, 8,000 pulsations per minute for deep and effective cleansing and 12 speeds, extra soft brush, which it's true, this is so soft, um, ultra hygienic with uh, silicone, which is another reason I bought this, is it's, it prevents bacteria buildup. It is a smart Swedish design, which obvi, look how cool this looks, and no replacement brushes needed, two year limited warranty. So I am super hyped I finally got this. I just started using it and already I can see that like when I go to put my toner after I wash my face, I usually always have a little bit of foundation left on um, the cotton swabs that I use, but what, since I've been using this, I don't have that. So I'm very, very excited. I feel like this is gonna make a big difference in my daily routine. Now let's get into some Zara purchases that I did um, earlier this week. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, I was actually Snapchatting with my sister while uh, we were shopping. I think it was on Monday. No, it was last Friday. So I picked up a few pieces and I filmed a video with one of the pieces and it's this white t-shirt here. You guys have been asking me what this is. I actually mentioned it. Guys, I always try to mention what it is that I'm wearing in the video if it's current season. It's not a brooch. A lot of people were asking me what my brooch was. It is not. It is part of the t-shirt and it's just this uh, white rolled sleeve t-shirt from Zara and it's part of the Zara collection and I got mine in a size small and it fits kind of nice baggy and like oversized so I'm really excited about this piece here. I can't remember prices on these but I think the whole, I, I bought three pieces and I think I paid under $200 so I it was affordable. 
The next piece I picked up, I'll show you guys some pictures because I did wear this already. It, this blazer here, it just has these gold buttons. It has the same gold buttons right here on the sleeve and it's kind of like a crepe almost. Um, it fits fabulously on this one. I picked mine up in a size small. Um, now that I've worn it a few times, I think I should have taken the extra small just because I feel like the fabric is given a little bit, but the small still fits great. And this is a repeat body. A friend of mine actually bought this exact same jacket last year. And when I saw it out this year, I was like, oh no, I need to buy this jacket. It was too good on her. Please excuse the wrinkles, but this shirt is also from Zara. It has a bit of a dolman sleeve. It's oversized, which you guys know is my jam. It just has the back pleat. It's nice and airy and I mean I just love this shirt um, this one is in a size small and back to I wore this with like a this navy blue jacket that I just showed you I paired it up with this this and a nice pair of dark blue jeans it just looked so chic together so I'm really happy to have found this piece. Last two pieces I'm gonna mention, I actually won a giveaway for them. So I follow Louise Rowe on Instagram. I love Louise Rowe. She has been one of my favorite fashion personalities for the longest time. And she had a giveaway on her channel and it was um, for her, it was for her collaboration with a brand that she was working with. And while well, I entered the giveaway just randomly, and I won! So uh, here is what I won, it's this vest here. It's from Louise Rowe's collection. By uh, for as by DF or AS by DF. I didn't actually know the um, brand that did this before, so I'm really happy I started following them on Instagram, and they have some really cool stuff. So this is the vest that I won. It is in suede. It comes with the gold zippers, and the back just has this kind of like Navajo um, tapestry almost embroidered. I love this look. So I am thinking this with like a white dress, throw this over it. It's nice and oversized too on me, so I got in the size small, and yeah, so I'm super hyped. So I can't wait to start styling this um, as soon as the weather breaks a bit. Last thing that I did end up getting in this giveaway is Louise Rowe's book. It's front row, How to Be a Leading Lady in Your Own Life. And um, it's actually signed by Louise Rowe, which I was really hyped about because I freaking love her. And I started going over this book. There's some such, there's some really great sketches in here. There's some really great photos. There's some really great tips. And yeah, I'm really, I'm loving, loving this. Oh yeah, before I forget, you guys are gonna ask me what is on my lips. Um, I am wearing the nude stick in the color Tamed. It is freaking awesome. It's super matte, but it's super hydrating. My lips aren't getting cracked at all right now. It's not kiss proof. Sorry, I just wanted to double check for you guys, but the color is exactly what it is I was looking for. and. I absolutely love it. On that note, guys, I am done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys like the idea of doing like favorites slash hauls, what I purchased during the month. And don't forget to thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. And I will see you in my next one, guys. Bye. Mwah. Fabric Mineral Texture Spray. So I put this in while my hair, like when I just come out of the shower. After I put in my mousse, I just spray this in. It has heat protectant in it. And um, it really does give that extra volume and it adds texture to your hair when it's just really clean. And then uh, for the flyaways on top, I put the Kango Feather Tenacious Hold. And I just put like literally like the size of a pea, rub it in my hands and I just put it on top of my hair to just lower all the, the fuzzies. And this really does give this, I mean it's paste, but it really does push down all those like flyaways and it keeps the volume and it doesn't take away what you've done as opposed to some of the paste I've used in the past. So these are my two hero products by Shu Aimura, this company right here. I'll show you guys some close-ups just so you guys can see what they look like. Um, but I also, I, they also sent me three other things which um, I haven't had a chance to try yet, but if you guys have, let me know because I'm looking forward to, looking forward to starting to use these. So they also sent me the Detail Master Directional Fixing Spray, so I'm guessing it's some sort of a hairspray. They also sent me the Texture Wave, it's a dry finishing spray, which you guys know me, I love that stuff. And they also sent me the Wonder Worker, so it's a blow dry perfecter. So I'm looking forward to try these three products during the month, uh, but for now, those two that I had showed you first off, those are my two favorites. All right, next, let's jump into jewelry. So I ordered some pieces from Ariel's new line, Ariel from Ariel Cristiana here on YouTube. She uh, came out with some jewelry pieces. I am so obsessed with it. I think it's called Delica um, for delicate, but in French. 
So I got my pieces yesterday and she threw in this extra necklace for me. So it's like a leather lariat and it just has these like dangle like little points at the end. And this is how it arrived. I thought it was really cute. So they all come in these little individual packages. So you have the little brown bags. It says the name on it in silver or if you have the silver bag, it comes with the gold writing. So this one is called the Needle Lariat. Absolutely love this piece. And then the two pieces that I had ordered are right here. So I have the Fitted Baguette Ring. So let me show you guys what that looks like. I got mine in a size I'm coming at you with my March purchases. So what I think I'm going to start doing is um, combining what I picked up and really loved during the previous month, so this month, March. So at every end of the month, instead of doing favorite videos, I am just going to do um, things that I picked up during the month that I've been loving. So basically with favorites, what I do hate about them is the fact that you can never get them when people show them because it is a few months later and stuff. So this way you guys will still be able to pick up everything is still current. This way I'm going to start doing like the hauls slash favorites at the end of every month. So if you guys are interested in what I picked up for the month of March and uh, some things that I'm obsessed with, keep on watching. Right, so I'm going to start with a few hair products. These were actually sent to me, uh, but basically because I've been doing my hair straight as opposed to wavy, uh, the way that I do it is completely different and I was looking for some new products and this stuff came in the mail right at the perfect time. I was sent uh, a range of this product. It is called, guys, I'm going to butcher the name, it's Shu Ayumura Art of Hair. So I was sent like five or six products from this brand and the two that I've been obsessed with is the Liquid Fat 5 because I wanted to do um, ring finger or pinky finger and it is adjustable. So it's the super cute gold plated ring. I got mine in gold and it has the little two um, stones. You have the round stone and the rectangle stone. I am so happy with this. It looks so beautiful on the hand. It looks so great with the stack that I usually wear and I'm really, really, really excited about having this piece added. Another piece that I ended up picking up are the bar earrings in silver. These are sterling silver. This is what they look like because I wear different earrings on on each ear, so I don't match my earrings, but this is the bar, what it looks like on my ear. I absolutely love this earring. It's so on trend. It's so perfect, and I love the fact all my earrings are sterling silver, so I don't need to take them off when I shower because they start taking off when you have piercings, like more than just two earrings. It's a little annoying, so it goes perfectly well with my day-to-day -day just earrings that I never take off, and those were called the bar earrings in silver. So I also picked up these little twirly earrings here. They're absolutely stunning. I picked them up from the primary website. Um, it's where you guys know I do 90% of my shopping. So uh, they're just these really cute like twirl earrings, and if you don't have multiple piercings, when you put them on it looks like you have like a second pierced hole which looks really really cute on. So I'm really excited about these. These have a really good price point. I have a coupon code below for these so I'm going to make sure to include them for 15% off on these bad boys. They come textured also. I got the smooth ones but the textured ones are also really really cool. Now from the primary website I finally bit the bullet and I bought a piece that I've wanted for a long time. It is this ring right here. It's a rose gold with real diamonds, evil eye. You guys know how I feel about evil eye. I have an evil eye here. I have one here. I have a tattoo. I like to feel protected. I like to get the bad juju away. So uh, I picked up this ring and it comes in so beautifully. This is how I received it. It's in a nice black box. The ribbon just says it's by Carbon and Hyde. It's the exclusive collection for Primary New York. So it just comes with a beautiful ribbon. It comes in a box like this that just says Carbon and Hyde. And here is the box it comes in. 